Hey Broncos, this is Kendra Cavney, one of the newest iBronco reporters. I'm here with Sofia Huerta on the women's soccer team. We're going to ask Sofia a few questions. Sofia, what are your plans this summer? Well, this summer I just really want to focus on improving a lot of my skills in soccer. I think I'm going to stay here and train with some of the coaches and do strength training and then go out on my own and work on finishing and anything that's going to get, prepare me for this upcoming season because being a junior, I'm an upperclassman now and the years have gone by so fast that I just want to take every moment for granted or I don't want to take any moment for granted. I just want to play the best that I can the next two years. So staying here and training and just getting a lot better for the upcoming season. So you have two teammates, Morgan and Julie, who are playing for the national team. How does it feel playing with them and how does it make you better as a soccer player? Well, Morgan is on the U23 team and I know she just had her last camp because she's over age now. And then Julie is with the full team currently right now. She's actually at camp with them. They're both spectacular players, honestly, on and off the field. They're just great people. Um, on the field, they know exactly what to say. And the best thing about them is that they just know what to do. They don't put much thought in what they're doing, and they make everyone around them a lot better. Morgan's great to play up with up top. Um, really great finisher. And what she does is she motivates everyone else to like work on things that they need to. And then Julie, is just she's a stud. I mean, she's a two-time All-American. She's on the full team as a college, a collegiate athlete. Um, and she just really wants the best for our team. I think playing with two players that are so, so just on a, a different level than everyone else makes us, you know, raise our bar to the next level. And I just think it makes our team a lot better. And it's, it's awesome playing with them. And I think personally, I improve a lot because I see them doing certain things that I want to change about myself. So I see Morgan make a run, then I'm going to make that run. I see Julie check to the ball, then I want to check to the ball. Mm -hmm. So they're not leaderships with their word or leaders with their words, but also just with their, um, their actions. So what are your expectations for the upcoming fall 2013 season? Well, I know a lot of people say this about their sports team, but I honestly feel like this is the first year that Santa Clara can win a national championship. Um, I know we won back we won one back in 2001, but it's been a long time, and I think we need to redeem ourselves. And we have a really solid team this year, and I think our team is very passionate as well. So not only do we have that the skills and the athleticism, but we also have the heart, and I think that's what's going to differentiate us from the other teams. We just we all really want it, and we all believe. So I think. Mm -hmm. With that, um, we have enough in it. Uh, that Are you looking forward to the incoming freshmen, and what do you hope to teach them? I think as a team, we're always excited to have a new group of girls come in just to see how we can incorporate them into our team and how much they're going to add to our team as well. Um, I know a lot of them are involved in national teams with the U.S. and with Mexico, and I think we're all really excited for them to come. And just as a, as a team, we're always excited to teach them the next level like I don't think people understand the, the big difference between club and high school soccer and then college soccer so I think just being able to have um, 18 year olds or whatnot come to our program and teaching them that the d dynamics of college soccer and just seeing how much they're going to help our team is probably the most exciting part mm -hmm. well that's it thank you Sophia for coming in today hope you have a great summer and we're looking forward to seeing you play next season um, that's it all for iBronco. This is Kendra Cavney signing out. Go Broncos.